In the words of Forrest Gump, stupid is as stupid does. Imagine the UN Conference on Global Diversity flying all of those delegates, thousands of people, millions of dollars, down to a big, huge conference in Pyongyang. Hey, there's Google Hangouts. Uh, but I brought this up because I want to discuss tactics and strategy. Now, strategy is good. The UN uh, biodiversity strategy is global plant conservation. Uh, we're 10 years into it now, a little slow, but hey, it's a great strategy. It's the tactics that I have issue with. Now, I hadn't wanted to get militant, but the level of despondency that I'm discovering in this uh, fight against industrial disease, and the despondency is towards um, fighting the problem or, or providing any solutions. So it's causing me to become reactionary to it. So I, I really want to get some things across uh, and make a point that it needs to be heard. This is a huge problem and we're not doing enough about it. There's tons of money available, but it's all stuck at the top end at conferences. And, and don't get me wrong, there's a lot of great people on the ground too. But it's the overall tactics that aren't working. Uh, and, and that's what, what I want to bring to the game here. I want to bring to the fight some really good tactics. But I want to uh, talk about a couple of things uh, from history to explain tactics and uh, where smaller armies or weaker armies defeated the larger armies. The three cases, you know, good examples is Vietnam versus USA. They use tunnels and jungle warfare. Uh, second really good example is Afghanistan versus Russia. You know, the Americans introduced the RPG, rocket propelled grenade, and uh, a small tag team, well, not that small, they had a lot of, a lot of people fighting, uh, but they were not centrally command, it wasn't a, an army per se, but the RPGs defeated Russia, nearly destroyed Russia and, and caused the end of the Cold War. Uh, also, the third one is Iraq versus USA. Now, Iraq beat them uh, using um, an insurgency tactic with uh, improvised uh, explosive de devices. Nasty, horrible, but again, what you see is three instances where weaker armies defeated larger armies using tactics. And the strategy was always the same, and it's the same as with the UN Global Biodiversity. The strategy is good. I'm not, I'm not arguing that. It's the tactics are not working. We need better weapons, and we need, uh, you know, a decentralized command informally on the ground. We use decision matrix, which only requires five people to set the RPG up in a place that it's going to bomb people effectively and make them wake up and stop doing what they're doing. Uh, you know, like I said, I didn't want to get militant about this, but I'm here on the ground and I can see what's going on. I'm on the front lines. This is the, the frontier that we're, we're working on here. And uh, the Rainforest Alliance is done an incredible job to put in front of us this huge opportunity because they assembled a bunch of artists together. You know, those artists have uh, real strong weapons and that, those weapons are their words. And tonight in this very park where I am, I'm going to meet the man called Amicida. And he is here in Ibera Puerta this evening. I'm going to try and get him to join our team and to, to learn this method of insurgency that I'm talking about, uh, teaching people WordPress and, and getting in the communities with the boots on the ground, small informal teams with decision matrix that can publish information and get it out there and make a difference, make an effect. And uh, I need your help to get this message to a larger crowd. I'm really, really pleased with how well our websites are coming along. So wildorchidbrazil.com is looking great. Please go there, join, comment, and, and pass it along to all your friends. Let's make some good stuff happen here, folks. I don't want to get in your face about this, but nobody seems to be listening. We have a giant opportunity. I'm in Brazil. I have a team. There's nothing to stop us. We're connected in Aguas Mornas with the school, with the computer center. We have all of the tools. We've got even resources behind us now. 
So we're going to start doing Google Hangouts ourselves and invite people to join us from all over the world and roll up their sleeves and let's plan this insurgency and let's start blowing some stuff up so people can hear us.